Hi, this video is on how to do uh, posting in WordPress. Uh, first of all, you have to obviously be logged in. I'm in the NTIT Tech site right now, uh, and I'm going to go ahead and post a, a new post here. So you go to Posts, and you can go straight to Add New. To add a new to post, you should come up with this editor right here. Now it's a normal um, web-based editor, so you can go ahead and type and... Um, add things right here and I'm going to go through and, and add some and I'm going to do it by just cutting and pasting uh, from another article so you don't have to watch me uh, typing while I do this. Okay, so I've added some text in there. Um, as I go when I'm writing, uh, even if I use a um, quote, which I did from this uh, 20 best LMS software solutions of 2020, I do the citation as I'm going so that I don't forget about it uh, and don't and forget, fail to give credit later. So this is just text. Obviously, I'm just typing text in. Uh, in this case, I've cut it and paste text in. And I also want to add a picture. So I'm going to go grab a picture that I can show you how to add a picture. Text, obviously, is easy. Formatting, we're just using the regular buttons up here to format. Uh, but how do I add a picture? And I'll show you that next. Okay, so I'm going to use this picture of the top free and open source LMS tools for small businesses. Uh, and I've already downloaded that picture, so I want to add it. So the first thing I did was I right-clicked on it and said Save Image As. And I downloaded that picture. And now I want to add uh, that picture in here into Moodle. I'm sorry, into... Uh, WordPress. So I'm going to say insert and I'm going to say media because uh, media is a picture. So uh, source, let's see the source. Paste your embed code advanced. Oh wait, it's not media. There must be an insert a picture. Insert. I haven't done it yet with the new browser. So hmm. Okay, I'm a Goomba. Right here, it says Add Media. I'm going to click that on there, and it says Drag or Drop or Select Files. So I have two options I can drag right onto here. I can click Select and go to my folder that I downloaded it to, which is this uh, top 10 free. There we go. So I just uploaded that into my site. You can see the other pictures that have already been uploaded by other students into the EdTech Teach uh, site. So I've got it uploaded. It's already checked. You can see I can check other ones, but and then I go down here in the bottom right-hand side and say insert into post. I can add alternative text. That's if you hover over it, and we want to do that if anyone comes to our site that's uh, visually impaired. So top free LMS options. Uh, and the title's there. I can make a caption that when you hover over it if I want to. I'm just going to click insert into post. So now that's in my post. Now it makes it a certain size. If I want to, I can drag that and make it bigger. We just really fuzz that up by doing that. So I'm going to leave it the way, way it was. And I'm going to, let's see, I'll center that up in my post right there. Uh, that is a terrible picture. I'm going to have to try to see if I can uh, increase my quality there. I don't know what happened. Let's see, there we go. Okay. I don't know what happened uh, because it says it looks pretty good. So I'm going to try to export it again. Export as, I'm going to save it to a JPEG file instead and see if that imports a little better. Export. Uh, I want my quality all the way up there. Uh, I don't need to save the XF data. Good enough. Okay, let's try that one and import that one into... I'm going to go ahead and, and uh, delete that. I'm going to put it here and add media again. Upload files. Let's try the other one I just made. Oh, look how much bigger that one is. I think that's, uh, I think that one's going to work a little better. And then, so it's uploaded. I'm going to say insert. In, oh, top free LMS. Um, Schmushing in progress. Oh, I forgot Schmush is on here. It's going to resize the post or the picture. And that's what's doing that to my photo. 
um, the smoosh process is what's lowering the quality of my photo. Hmm, I might turn that sucker off because it is definitely making it worse and this really this photo is no good at that quality. I wonder if I can tell it not to smush. Um, four images reduce image size. You know what, I'll work on Schmoosh later. Uh, right now, you can see how to add the picture in there, and that's probably good enough because yours probably is just a photo. Mine's something I want somebody to read, so it's it's not very good in there. So you just click the Add Media. Uh, when you add media, you, you upload it into uh, WordPress, and then you can see all the other media that's uploaded. You just check it and then insert it into the post. I just have to fix that... Um, that option there. Uh, you also can insert it straight from a URL if you found it someplace else. Um, you don't have to upload it into WordPress. Uh, the only problem with when we do that is if we insert from an, someone else's URL and they delete it, it's also deleted from our post. That's the downside of doing it that way. So I'm going to leave it at that. I think that's it. Um, these tools are all normal tools uh, that we use all the time. And um, the text editor is pretty much it. Once you're done, after you've saved your draft, you can go and publish it. I'm not going to publish this. I'm actually going to finish this uh, post, and then I'm going to post it as a real post later. So I'm going to leave it in the draft mode. I am going to make sure I take it out of the uncategorized and take it down to uh, my staff tech reviews uh, down here. And I'll save draft again so that's saved. And then I'm going to stop my recording now.